Yeah, there, that works. I'll show you what happens if you leave this rubber gasket off. As you can see, paint bubbling in the color cup. Not good. <clears throat> One of three reasons. One, you have still dried paint inside the nozzle. Or the nozzle's cracked and you didn't uh, pick it up when you cleaned it, you didn't see it. Or you forgot to put this rubber gasket in between the cap and the body. Or <clears throat> the gasket, it isn't tight. So when you push down on the trigger, it bubbles back through the color cup. If the nozzle's fine, and you know it is, just tighten the air cap a little against the gasket until it doesn't bubble. So there's three reasons that the, you're going to get paint bubbling back through the air cup, air back through the color cup. Uh, one, you have a cracked nozzle. Two, you have dried paint or just a speck of dried paint inside the nozzle. Or three, you forgot to put this gasket in or it's not, you didn't tighten it down far enough. So those are the three reasons you're going to get paint bubbling back to the air cup, the collar cup. This is the ba uh, Badger Patriot 105. It's a great airbrush. Visit your Badger retailer for more information. You can't go wrong buying this airbrush. I hope this video helps you. This is Don at How To Airbrush. Until next time, it's just paint, relax, and have fun.